What's up, YouTube? Dub K Dad, Team DKF. Crazy deck idea time. For those of you keeping up with my blog, um, you have heard the name for this deck today. And we'll just take a peek. The name of this deck today is called Pink Cookies in a Plastic Bag. Um, kudos to you if you can get the reference. And uh, again, just a little quick overview. And now let's look into the deck list. Three Tregos, Dark Arm, Gores, Two Chaos Sort, Chaos, Cyber Dragon, Dark Greffer, Two Herald of Creation, Two Dimensional Alchemists, Two Neko Gardener, Gale, Plague, and Cyber Valley. For spells, Two or uh, Giant Trunade, Storm, Smashing. My body has a shield, brain control, two allure and reinforcement of the army, traps, three reckless, two legacy, torrential, uh, solemn judgment, two royal oppression, mirror force, two bombless trap hole, and call the haunted. All right, let me explain some of the card choices and some of the combos uh, we have here. Um, uh, one of the things that screams off the top of your head is running Royal Oppression, Call the Haunted, and Gores together. You know, to most deck builders, that just screams no. But as I noticed that in Black Wings, you can run <coughs> uh, Gores alongside Oppression, alongside uh, Black Whirlwind. And it just seems, you know, that you can, we can do that here. There won't always be times where you'll have Royal Oppression on the field and uh, for those times, Call the Hunter is great, especially when you can combo it off a of, um, Heavy Storm or MST, activate Call on Dimensional Alchemist, it dies, you add a card from your move from play back to your hand because it was destroyed. Um, you know, other benefits, <coughs> excuse me, uh, bringing back your Trego when he's really huge, you have lots of cards in hands allowing you to synchro over and over again by bringing back uh, tuners. Um, also, let's talk about the usual tricks you can do with alchemists, you know, bringing back uh, necros back to your hand. Um, you lure away a sorcerer, they think they're safe. You lure away dark arm, they think they're safe. You lure away a trego, a gores, etc., etc. This dies, you get any of those back to your hand. Um, abuse of Plague, again, Abuse of Cyber Valley. Um, and we just picked these two standard tuners. I didn't want to run any light tuners or any other tuners. These are the best two tuners in the game, hands down. I really don't care what anyone else has to say about it. Um, this is just reusable. You can use this one tuner twice in one turn um, without any other help except for one card in your hand. And not only is Gale a level 3 tuner gives you Black Rose or Armor Master or gives you a Stardust um, it also can it's like the best out to Stardust and any other monster under 2500 attack by itself so I mean there's no other cards that can do what these two do and that's why you would not want to run any other cards uh, some I've seen builds run uh, Black Salvo in combination with Dekoichi. Um, it's not a, not bad, but I don't like it because I don't want to set that often because um, a lot of times you're not going to get your Dekoichi off uh, and when you do, you know, you're going to be upset because um, you, you flip it, you draw, and then you can't capitalize and there aren't a whole lot of good level 7 tuners anymore. We don't have Dark Strike. Uh, potentially you could make that you know power tool with limiter removal you know but I would just prefer to rely on the chaos engine because this way you know I can jack this by any level except for level 8 um, with Dragodia and whatever I can't jack I can remove it remove it kill it so uh, that's why I chose to go this way Alright YouTube, uh, please rate, comment, 
subscribe if you haven't tell me what you think and the name of the deck is pink cookies in a plastic bag getting crushed by building 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 dub k dad and i'm out